American Pickers star Frank Fritz maintained his humor, even until the end. American Pickers star Frank Fritz had a rough final few years before he passed last week. The star battled health issues, limited mobility, and complications. But he remained unapologetically frank despite what life threw his way. There's something inspiring about holding on to yourself despite what life throws at you. Everybody wants an ace, but sometimes life hands you a couple of twos, or threes or God forbid a joker. These past few years, Frank was playing through a bad hand, but the reality star kept his sense of humor. Previously, inside sources spoke with a U.S. son about Fritz and his health issues. In 2022, the American Pickers star suffered a stroke. It left him wheelchair-bound and unable to move half of his body. He has been bad since the stroke, and he had been getting worse, an inside source said. The star struggled with mobility. He was unable to move the right side of his body. He needed 24-hour care. There was no way he was getting better. He was in a home. Fritz couldn't walk long distances following the stroke. He can walk, but he's always going to need the wheelchair because he can't walk long distances, a source said. Basically, you lose motion. He lost motion. A stroke can affect your left or your right side. It affected his right side. Sometimes it's easy to just want to give up when bad things like this happens. But Fritz maintained his good nature, according to friends. They said, he's the same old Frank. He has a good attitude and a great sense of humor. We crack jokes all the time. You gotta make the best of the situation, so he's come to terms with all of that. His mind is right, he's a happy guy, and his sense of humor is there. That being said, Fritz did experience some impairment due to his stroke, sadly. Prior to his death, one of Fritz's friends, Chris Davis, acted as his guardian. Meanwhile, Midwest Own Bank acted as a conservator. Because of his stroke, Mr. Fritz's decision-making capacity is so impaired that he is unable to care for his own safety or to provide for necessities such as food, shelter, clothing, or medical care, without which physical injury or illness may occur. Documents obtained by the U.S. Sunread. Mr. Fritz's decision-making capacity is so impaired that he is unable to make, communicate, or carry out important decisions concerning his own financial affairs. Decisions must be made for Mr. Fritz's care and placement while he continues to recover and receive treatment for his injuries. Frank Fritz, the beloved star of American Pickers, was known for his infectious humor, easygoing charm, and unshakable spirit, which endeared him to fans across the world. Even in the final years of his life, when health challenges and personal struggles weighed heavily on him, Frank maintained his trademark wit, a light that shone brightly until the very end. As a co-star of American Pickers, Frank had a way of making every dusty barn, old relic, or forgotten treasure seem like a gateway to an exciting adventure. Alongside his longtime friend, Mike Wolf, Frank brought history to life with his sharp eye for antiques and rare finds. Whether he was unearthing a vintage motorcycle or haggling over a sign from the 1920s, Frank always approached the pick with a mix of enthusiasm and humor. He didn't just collect things. He collected stories, and more often than not, laughter followed him wherever he went. Frank's humor was never mean-spirited. It was the kind that came from a man who genuinely loved life and enjoyed making others smile. He had a knack for poking fun at himself, especially when he would squeeze into small spaces or handle something he clearly didn't have the patience for. Fans recall countless moments when he'd make a sarcastic quip, only to burst into a wide, infectious grin that made it impossible not to laugh along with him. But it wasn't just his on-screen persona that captivated people. Those who knew Frank personally saw that his humor was deeply ingrained in who he was. 
It was his way of connecting with people and navigating life's ups and downs. Whether he was sharing a meal with friends or striking up a conversation with a stranger, Frank could always find a way to lighten the mood with a joke or a playful jab. In the later years of his life, Frank faced significant health issues. After leaving American Pickers in 2021 due to back surgery complications, he was diagnosed with Crohn's disease, a condition that had plagued him for years. He also suffered a debilitating stroke, which further tested his physical and mental endurance. Despite these setbacks, Frank's sense of humor never faltered. Friends close to Frank often remarked on how he used laughter as a means to cope. In the hospital or at home recovering, he'd crack jokes with the nurses, making them laugh even when he was in pain. Frank had this way of making the hardest moments feel lighter, one friend shared. Even when he wasn't feeling his best, he'd find something funny to say. It was his way of saying, hey, I'm still here, I'm still Frank. Even during the difficult days of rehabilitation after his stroke, Frank was known to turn the experience into a comedic bit. I may not be able to walk straight, but I'll still outpick Mike any day. He once joked, referring to his friendly rivalry with Mike Wolf, his former co-star. It was these moments that reminded those around him that Frank's humor wasn't just an act for television. It was the essence of who he was. In fact, his humor remained a point of connection between him and his fans, even after his exit from the show. On social media, Frank's followers would often leave comments expressing their love for his one-liners and memorable moments on American Pickers. In return, Frank would post the occasional witty update or share a photo with a caption that showcased his humor hadn't been dulled by time or circumstance. One particularly touching example of Frank's humor shining through in tough times came during one of his last interviews. When asked about his health struggles, Frank smiled and said, I've been through worse. Like the time I had to drag Mike out of a hoarder's attic with a 50-pound sign. The interviewer chuckled, and so did Frank, as if to remind everyone that no matter how hard life got, there was always something to laugh about. Frank's enduring wit was also a source of comfort to his friends and family, especially in the later stages of his life. His close friend, Bob, who visited him regularly, shared that even when Frank's physical condition deteriorated, his spirit remained unbroken. He'd always have a joke ready, Bob said. Even when he could barely speak, he'd still manage a grin and say something like, well, at least I'm not six feet under yet. And it was that fighting spirit, that refusal to let the weight of his struggles overshadow his joy, that truly defined Frank Fritz. His humor became a beacon of resilience, a reminder that even when faced with the most difficult challenges, one can still find reasons to smile, to laugh, and to connect with others. When the news of Frank's passing spread, tributes poured in from across the world. Fans, friends, and fellow pickers shared stories, not just of Frank's incredible eye for antiques, but also of his warmth, kindness, and above all, his humor. Mike Wolf, reflecting on their years together, said in a statement, Frank was more than a coworker, he was a brother. And no matter what, he could always make me laugh. Even on the toughest days, Frank found the humor in everything. In the end, Frank Fritz's legacy isn't just about the treasures he discovered or the deals he made. It's about the joy he brought to those around him. Whether through the TV screen or in his personal interactions, Frank had an incredible ability to lift people's spirits. His humor was a testament to his resilience, showing that no matter how hard life got, he could still find something to smile about. Frank may be gone, but his laughter, his jokes, and his lighthearted approach to life will forever remain in the hearts of those who knew him and those who loved watching him work his magic on American pickers. Even until the end, Frank Fritz maintained his humor, because that's who he was, a man who could always find the joy in the journey.